Mrs. Shepard, what story are you going to read us today? Well, well, let's see what we have. What is a friendship? How does it occur? What trials can true friendship overcome? From this story, you will learn how a young magician met a young inventor and how they created their first brotherhood. Bye, Mom! Study well, and don't blow anything up there, Folly. I probably won't go to school today. More interesting things await me in my shelter. Someone made a camp here. Where is the owner? I can get through before the bees return. I need belaying equipment to descend into the canyon. I hid it somewhere here. I hope no one found it. Why the goblin is my ascender lying here? Strange. I left it in a hiding place. Someone went down the cliff badly, and I've always said that you shouldn't do it without belaying.
Dang it! Someone found out about my secret shelter and found one of the keys, and even hid it in the schoolyard. This is very mean. There's a lesson going on now, and no one is running around in the yard. I need to be quiet, otherwise Mr. Dornard could hear me. If I were a nasty, stinking goblin, where would I hide someone else's key? What's all the noise here? Mr. Fulner Bogro. Here we go. Mr. Bogro, you're skipping class again. Does your mother know you're not at school? Yes. You see, I am now intensively preparing a project for the school fair. The project must be completed outside of school hours. It is not for your creation you decided to disassemble the fountain, I hope. Mr. Bogro, I think you're taking me for a fool. No, sir. What are you talking about? I will definitely talk to your mother. Since you are so inquisitive and love mechanisms, you'll have to please fix the fountain. All the necessary parts are in the bar. When you're done, you're welcome to your lessons. Do you understand, young man? Yes, sir. It will be done. Tough luck. Now I also have to repair the fountain. Okay. The teacher gave me a key to the barn, though. Perhaps that is where my key is. What a mess. I should find the pipeline parts somewhere in this trash. Well, the key to the shelter, too. If I'm lucky. He's gone. Well, I didn't find my key, but I still have to fix the fountain. There it is! My key! Wow, how high!
Where did it fall? Finally, I have the key. Let's go to the shelter. My shelter. I do here whatever I want and not what they say. I can finally finish my project for the school fair. Power multiple. Physics is my only favorite subject. Well, and also technology.
Wow, it fit. This means that this is the camp of that poor guy from the canyon. Fulner pulled the first lever. Two stones were connected. Lightning struck! Then Fulner connected the other two stones, and the apparatus emitted a frosty cloud. Hmm. What if... Then he decided to connect all the stones at the same time. The cave rumbled after the explosion, causing the stone wall with ancient inscriptions to crack. Oh, my head! What an explosion! Oh no, my ancient inscriptions have been damaged! Wait, what is this? Stalactites! There's a whole dungeon here! There's some architecture in the distance. I need to take a closer look. Hidden treasures! This is getting interesting. It looks like the elements of water and fire are depicted on the gate. I think it might be related to the statues. Wow, wow. It looks like a sarcophagus and some runes. What's the connection? It's falling! Oh, well, how can I get to the gate now?
There's a whole city here. I need to look around. Maybe I'll actually find the sarcophagus. Fulner! Who's there? Fulner! Take me with you! Mora! You scared me! What are you doing here? How did you even find my shelter? Can you guess? I figured out long ago where you were running away from home. Who do you think took your key? I wanted to use it, but I got angry when I realized that there should be two keys. And I hid the first one in the schoolyard. Oh, you little. I had to fix the fountain because of you. What's more, Dornord will tell our mother everything. I'll also tell mom about your shelter if you don't take me with you. Dang it! Okay, stay close. I don't know what kind of place this is or who might dwell here. What are we looking for, Folly? Sarcophagus with treasures. And don't call me Foley. Forge, Mora. All dwarves are blacksmiths in some way. I'm gonna cast a new part.
don't know yet, but I think we activated something. The rumors were true. Apparently, you need to draw out specific runes with a quill. Something changed in the sarcophagus. Fulner pushed back the lid of the sarcophagus with an effort. The darkness in the temple thickened, and a mysterious whisper came. What is this? Fulner? I'm afraid. The open sarcophagus revealed a skeleton with a large, beautiful dagger on its chest. This knife is beautiful. The treasure hunter was probably writing about this treasure in his notes. Folly, please, let's get out of here. The children grabbed one another's hands and ran as fast as they could from the dark dungeons. Wait, wait, I can't run anymore. What was that, Fulner? I don't know, but it was scary. Please, let's go home already. Of course, Mara. Anyway, school time is already over, so we can't go back. Just don't tell Mom where we were. What happened here? Why is everything broken? Was there a tornado? Mom? Where are you? I hope Mom is in the house. The 
the backyard is also devastated. However, the gate and the door are closed. Nobody went through them. like that. Physics. Exactly. Thank you, Mora. I just read about this in a physics textbook today. Power multipole. Today I read about it in a textbook. A device for lifting large loads with little effort. locked from the inside, but I don't have the key. Sir, go! Hey, buddy! Don't be afraid. It's us. What happened here? What did you see? Mom, are you okay? She seems to have a fever. Look, she's holding some kind of note in her hand. Hang in there, Mom. We'll get everything done. What do we need to collect for the recipe?
think this dead tree is unnecessary in the garden. My head is still in a fog, but I feel better now. Thank you, my darlings. Mom, who was here? It was some kind of unknown beast, but I couldn't see it. It was as fast as lightning. As soon as I turned around towards the sound, it was no longer there. It was always ahead of my vision. It was so scary. Shh, Mom. There's no danger anymore. We're with you. And weren't you hurt, my children? No, we were just... At school. Mora visited me there, and then we returned home together. Never mind. Mom, I have to catch this beast before it causes even more trouble. Where did it go? I don't know for sure, but the last noise I heard came from... The Western Gate. I think it went to the Ancestral Rock. Son, this is very dangerous. Since Father joined our ancestors, I have to protect our family. Mom, please give me the key to the closet. I need a seal from my father's crypt. Why, son? It's time to take my father's hammer. Mora? Stay with Mom.
What happened here? It looks like there was an avalanche. Is it the fault of the same beast? It all makes sense. The poor guy started digging and caused an avalanche. It looks like this guy and his horse slipped down with a piece of the road. That's sad. However, I found the treasure. Our family's crypt. Father is buried in the crypt, along with his grandfather's hammer. Hi, everyone. Hello, Aunt Lo. Her circo is still with us. Hello, Grandfather. Today, I will put your... Hello, Grandma. Miss you. Hello, Uncle Bibi. How are you? What does it mean to honor the memory? Maybe they mean to bring flowers to the graves. Which ones?
Oh no, the school was also attacked. I hope Mr. Dornard and the students were not harmed. I didn't mix anything up and grew what I needed. Hello, Father. Long time no see. Today I need something that belongs to you. Fulner bravely stepped out of the dungeon, holding his father's hammer. Suddenly, a bunch of black smoke hit him in the back. Fulner has fallen. What was it? Was it a beast? It's not a beast. What is it? You almost killed my mother. The strange entity passed through Fulner and attacked him in the back again. Fulner began to lose strength. Before losing consciousness, he saw a mysterious figure of the man who attacked the entity with magic. <laughs> 